Star Park Lore is back and in a whole new form. While previously we could only listen to a radio, we now also have a series of visual components as well, in the form of CCTV. These security screens survey the park to make sure no unacceptable behavior is going on in the premises, which was actually hinted at back in the most recent Brawl Talk, where we saw a mysterious man watching these screens, and this guy appears to be a security guard by the name of Rick. Rick is newly employed and knows absolutely nothing about what goes on here, so something tells me he's going to be in for a real treat. But there is the question of how we're even able to see Rick, and the in-game answer is by clicking RT's security camera on the lobby screen. This seems to open up some sort of back door to which we're able to slip through a time and space anomaly, which leads us to security room 2E. Now if we think back, Spewed has been the active force driving against Star Park, and I actually think they're the ones who have opened this anomaly, or had some part in it, because this could have easily been placed on the WKBRL YouTube channel, currently controlled by Star. But where did they put it instead? The StarPark.biz website, which is the only place that we know of that is currently run by Spewed. Plus, there's also the newest video from the YouTube channel, which denies any involvement with the CCTV, meaning that these leaks are not officially associated, so either it was an accident, or it's another attack on Star Park where the cameras that were meant to watch us are, ironically, allowing us to watch them. There's also several other things on the website which are able to be clicked on, such as this phone, and while nothing is happening with it yet, considering it has a click box, that probably means that we will be able to interact with it sometime in the future. There's also the Star Park security system log, which, in theory, will allow us to archive security footage that has played in the past, and this is actually an amazing addition, because previously, if you wanted to replay an audio on WKBRL that was not looping, like Jesse being locked out or the rant, you either had to scroll back hours and hours or look it up on an archive, but if this does what I think it does, then we'll be able to watch any major events that will only happen once as much as we want in one place. So if you have other things to do in your day other than watching a looping TV screen, you won't be punished for missing it. And this would also let people who don't know about the lore see all these events too, and hopefully that will get people even more interested in the story. But as of the moment, we don't have any time codes to input here. There were some ones in the video that the official Brawl Stars channel posted, but they don't seem to work right now. Now, or at least they haven't been fully figured out, so it looks like we're just going to have to wait. Then there's also Rick's logbook, which will likely update daily, and this is another thing that should keep people's interest and have the community checking in repeatedly. Currently, there's only a handful of entries, but it is only the beginning, and they're almost certainly going to be updating it extensively. The last thing you can click on are the TV screens themselves, which show a whole bunch of the park's surroundings. We can see the Starcade, Bull's Diner, the inside of Bull's Diner, what appears to be the hub and gate, and the Rumble Jungle as well. And we now have confirmation that the Ferris wheel's on the border of Bull's Diner and Frontier World with it being called the Shooting Star. There's so much going on and I am so excited. My only quarrel with the whole thing is that you can't interact with the coffee mug. Supercell, this is just undignified. Let me drink Rick's coffee. It's just gonna sit there. Nobody wants to drink cold coffee. Rick certainly doesn't. It's been sitting there since 1995. If he hasn't, nobody else is gonna. But for now, that's all we have. Time anomalies, glitching brawlers, and CCTV cameras. Sounds like we're gonna be in for one big mystery. So keep your eyes peeled and until next time, make sure to have a day as bright as the stars.